Huh. Huh? Huh. A double huh. Get the pencil and paper. Uh-huh. I got an idea. The Hollywood Chocolate Boy, Timothy Chalamet, is all set to play the role of the eccentric chocolatier, Willy Wonka, in the new Wonka movie coming up this December. Of course, this can come as a shock to many of us, considering he has earned his name and fame by winning us over with his brilliant roles in Dune and Call Me By Your Name. These movies and the roles definitely don't come close to the weirdness and uniqueness of an iconic character like Willy Wonka, but his bestie Zendaya surely thinks that Timothy can pull off this role. Want to know more about Wonka and Timothy Chalamet? Keep watching. Before we go into the video, make sure to give us a like and share. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to be notified every time we post new content. So without any further delay, let's jump right into the video. Willy Wonka is surely an iconic character. We don't think there is anyone out there who didn't grow up watching Charlie and the Chocolate Factory and daydreaming about how wonderful it would be to have a chocolate river running by our home. Gene Wilder and Johnny Depp brilliantly portrayed the awesome yet kind of crazy personality of Wonka. So it kind of makes us wonder how much justice the new Willy Wonka, Timothy Chalamet, can do to this character. The new film, Wonka is a fresh take on the beloved character created by Roald Dahl, coming from Warner Bros. and directed by Paddington's Paul King. Timothy is set to become the third actor in Hollywood history to step into the shoes of the famed chocolatier, only after Gene Wilder in 1971 and Johnny Depp in 2005. Chalamet shared the first look at the new film in October 2021 when he posted an Instagram photo of himself in costume as Wonka. He captioned it as, the suspense is terrible. I hope it will last. Referencing a line from Wilder's version of the movie. Wonka is slated to premiere theatrically on December 15th this year. It will go in depth into the origin stories of the chocolate maestro, then still just a humble chocolate lover for the first time. The movie, which will also have a musical aspect, is said to chronicle Willy Wonka's fantastical journey across the world before he established his legendary chocolate factory. As per Warner Bros. Source, the film will tell the vivid, mythical beginnings of the imaginative young inventor before he becomes the renowned, scrum diddly umptious Mozart of chocolate. What a description, right? Not too long ago, we had gotten a peek at Chalamet's new uniform as Willy Wonka. This costume is a masterpiece envisioned by costume designer Lindy Hemming, which includes a velvet burgundy jacket, a silk necktie, and the character's iconic brown top hat. The first trailer for the film was unveiled earlier this summer, while the second trailer was released on October 12th. Both trailers give us a taste of Timothy's take on the chocolatier. We can actually hear Chalamet's young Willy Wonka say, You see, I'm something of a magician, inventor, and chocolate maker. Although, sadly, we didn't get to hear any of the actual musical aspects of the film play out in the trailers, we can see a lot of dancing. We also see Wonka's rapport with co-star Kala Lane, who plays a young orphan named Noodle. She appears to be Wonka's main support system and confidant, as we see the pair go from seemingly strangers to partners in chocolate crime literally soaring through the sky. There's also the hilarious addition of Hugh Grant as the first Oompa Loompa Chalamet's Wonka works with. You all remember the Oompa Loompas, right? Without a doubt, they are one of the most iconic characters in the Willy Wonka universe, as well as the most noted workers in Willy Wonka's factory. If you've watched the two films based on Dolls Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, you probably associate them with orange skin and short stature and their native land of Loompa Land. But in this movie, it is gonna be Hugh Grant. Yeah, that's right. The renowned British actor Hugh Grant is the leading Oompa Loompas in Paul King's Wonka. According to the director, and as noted by Entertainment Weekly, Grant is no taller than knee high and will be singing and dancing galore. The trailer also confirms that Oompa Loompas, or at least Grant's Oompa Loompa in particular, has a British accent and is actually more sardonic in nature than ever before. Although this film gives us a lot to look forward to, there are several people out there who seriously doubt if Timothy is the right fit for this role. After all, Willy Wonka is a one-of-a-kind character who has got a special place in our hearts. We cannot have some guy screw that up, can we? However, several of his close friends think that he is going to be the perfect Wonka. This also includes the IT girl Zendaya. Although Zendaya hasn't publicly said anything about Timothy's new role, we are sure that she wants nothing but the best for him and will go to any end to support him. Their beautiful friendship goes back to when they met for filming Dune. In an interview, she opened up about her friendship with him. She has called him wonderful, talented, and even said that the actor is a good friend to have. She also said, especially in this industry, it's nice to have other people who are going through it too. 
and that you can talk to. Timothy has also proved himself to be an awesome friend. He put out the sweetest message for Zendaya for her birthday, and also revealed that she was one of the most inspiring people he has encountered. The birthday girl Zendaya replied to the tweet by saying how Chalamet's wishes made her tear up. When it came to Timothy's birthday, Zendaya uploaded an Instagram story featuring a behind-the-scenes image of him in his Paul Atreides getup. It's an honor to watch his talents at work, but even more of an honor to be able to call him a friend, she wrote in the story. Zendaya once revealed that she wanted to star in this sci-fi movie even before the producers were on with casting people. She said, Before they were even looking at people, I heard about it. And I was like, I really want to get in the room. They weren't looking in my direction. And I was like, hey, I'm here. But while giving an interview, Zendaya admitted that she felt very intimidated to act alongside the major cast members of Dune. But she has no reason to. Ever since the first Spider-Man movie, she has slowly climbed the ladder of fame and has made it to the top. But for some reason, she felt the pressure of giving her best, but spending time with Timothy proved to be reassuring. I was like, I want to do my best work, you know? But this guy made it such a warm environment to work in. Timothy is also one of Zendaya's besties because he truly gets her. She said, so he was like, awesome, someone who understands my jokes. He's obviously a very talented actor, but just a wonderful person and a good friend to have. Timothy added by saying that the two stars were able to have fun breaks in between takes, even though they hadn't met before shooting Dune. He said, We got in a nice, beautiful rhythm. Zendaya also couldn't stop gushing about their time together at the sets. In her appearance on The Late Show with Stephen Colbert, she said that one of her favorite memories from her Dune experience was having awesome impromptu dance parties with Chalamet. Where I would leave the door open, Timothy would come in with his little speaker, and then everybody would start coming in and we would just start dancing, she explained. She also hinted that she was a fan of Timothy's choice of music. She added that it was a blast from the past. She recalled, he just rolled up with his little boombox and would play 2000s dance songs like Soulja Boy. Aw, how wonderful is Zendaya's and Timothy's friendship. What do you think of Timothy playing Willy Wonka? Do you think he can perfectly capture the essence of the character? Let us know in the comments down below. Also, make sure to give us a big thumbs up and share this video with your friends. Don't forget to turn on the notifications. We will be back soon with another awesome video. Until then, bye.